There, this is Blake Levine, and today I want to do a soothing and calming meditation to help you to bring more peace and serenity into your life. So for some of us, there's times where things seem confusing, we're struggling to find our path, and we begin to have fears, and we begin to have sadness. And I want to share today some tools to help you get back to a place of joy, a place of peace, a place of love, and a place of hope. The first tip today is to say, I am going to accept myself. I realize that I may have made some mistakes, but I love that I am here on earth trying to learn, trying to grow, and trying to have a healthy life. You may also tell yourself that God loves you exactly as you are. You may have been through many problems or faced many obstacles, but God loves and accepts you exactly as you are today. You're not a mistake. You're here for a reason, and God adores you exactly as you stand today. The next suggestion is to be able to say, you know what? I am allowing myself to be peaceful. Sometimes I come into nature because when I feel the wind blowing and the calmness of the lake and the beauty of the trees and the plants, it helps me to know that there is serenity around me. Often in our lives we can have such fast pace worrying about money, worrying about what we're going to do and trying to let our ego take over. And I found that when you get to a place of peace, it helps yourself to be able to say, you know what, it's going to work out. Our minds often are always looking for the answers. We want to know what's going to be next. We want to understand what's going to happen. But part of life is the unknown. And I believe when you have trust and faith, things work out. When you're trying to push too hard or you're trying to make things happen, sometimes they don't go as well. I found in my life the days and the times that I just let things be and I do what I can and wait for answers, things work out in a happier and more peaceful way. The final tip I want to say to you today is that no matter what's happened in the past, today is a new opportunity. Today you can find yourself being more calm. Today you can be able to have more self-love. Today you can be able to start something fresh. Maybe you begin an exercise routine. Maybe you start eating healthier. Maybe you try to join some type of group that has support or has other people in it. And when you do that and you say, you know what, I'm making the best of today, oftentimes things work out. I want to thank you so much for watching this video here. We have lots of educational ones on YouTube. I love to share my lessons and teach. I also have a life coaching program where I work with people by phone from all over the world. You can learn about it on my website, BipolarOnline.com. And I pray for you that everything gets better and more joyful. And as we hear the wind blowing and we see the beauty, we know that life is going to work out for all of us.